A lightning strike has claimed the life of a 53 year old man. Yeah, it happened in the parking lot of a rodeo Friday night in the small town of Holden in Johnson County, Missouri. KMBC 9's Andy Alcock is getting answers about this rare event. According to the Holden, Missouri Police Department, emergency responders came here just after 11 o'clock on Friday night. They found Dr. Rob Espy, a veterinarian and rodeo enthusiast, had been struck by lightning. Tragically, Espy, who worked with his father at this Grain Valley Vet Center, did not survive. The CDC reports it's about a million to one shot to get hit by lightning, and nearly 90% of the people who do live to tell about it. That's why I do what I do. You know, I try to get the word out. Johnson County Emergency Management Agency Director Darren Tobias says there were reports of up to 2,500 lightning strikes from the storm before it ever reached the Johnson County line. The county, in conjunction with FEMA and the National Weather Service, uses what's called the Integrated Public Alert and Warning System, or IPAWS. It connects to cell phones and other electronic devices by location through cell phone towers. According to Tobias, an IPAWS severe weather warning for Johnson County, Missouri, went out at 10.35 p.m. EMS was called on the lightning strike at 11.09 p.m. 34 minutes after that warning. Everybody did a great job that night and getting the warnings out and even, even on further on from there. Tobias says with the potential for more severe weather over this extended holiday weekend, it is very important for everyone to be alert. In Warrensburg, Andy Alcock, KMBC 9 News. The CDC also reports Missouri is one of the leading states for lightning deaths.